Hi guys, welcome to Office Bloke's Reacts. I'm Office Bloke Dave. I'm Office Bloke Mike. I'm the office repairman for the air conditioning unit. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were just going to be the office. Like, That's profound. <laughs> uh, we are the Office Blokes. We've got a couple of other YouTube channels. We talk utter nonsense, as you may be able to tell. Uh, we try stuff as well. Patreon page, social media, all that good stuff. And merch. merch. Look at it. Link in the description will take you where you need to go. And uh, we're trying to build the social media side, aren't we? Yeah. Our personal ones, anyway, to yep. become influencers. I've got 760 odd followers now, so I'm basically. I'm on a strange number, 789. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I'm, I'm, I'm going to unfollow you, so you're 788, just to ruin it. That's what <laughs> I'm on a strange one as well. Zero. Zero. Yeah. Yeah. You got, you got no friends. <laughs> oh, I don't want any. Pain in the ass. <laughs> anyway, we're. Uh, I, I saw this last night, and obviously me having a skateboarding background and never mentioned blading and, and sort yeah, of growing up. Never mentioned that, has he? Growing up, what like growing up watching football for you guys? Although I did watch it as well. You can't use the word grown up and skateboarding <laughs> in the same sentence. <laughs> I I grew up watching the X Games though. Like that. That was a, a th you know yeah. always every year watch the X Games. And uh, Sky Brown is representing us at the Tokyo Olympics coming okay. up soon. And she uh, skates down in Salford. Oh, really? Grace down some of the time. Um, this is a Sky Brown, hometown, Miyazaki. Yeah, I, I think she's. So I'm not sure she's from Salford, mate. I don't know what part Salford <laughs> no, no, is. She's, she's not from Salford. She represents the UK, but I think she lives in. I think she lives half the year in Japan and half the year in Hawaii. Right. Because right. she surfs half the year and is a pro skateboarder the other wow. half the year. And she's yeah. from Salford. No, she she skated at the skate park in Salford okay. quite a lot. There's pictures of her up all over the place. Um, so she's a skateboarder. She's, she's a skateboarder. thirteen. She's thirteen years old. Point and proved. <laughs> this, yeah, but this is her. <laughs> A bit old for a skateboard. <laughs> She's representing our country at the Olympics. This is why I'm showing you so you can Retire, get behind her. Retiring straight after I didn't it. even know it was in the Olympics. Yeah, it's the first year at the Tokyo Olympics. Um, so this, she won the X Games um, Women's Park, I think it was, literally a couple of days ago. Yeah. So this is her winning run. Okay. But I just thought it'd be cool to watch because she's rep she is, you know, we'll be cheering her on in the Olympics. Yeah, yeah excellent. Good. Um, so this is her final run. This is the thing that, that won the X Games yeah. for her. Bear in mind, she's 13 when you see some of the stuff she's doing yeah. as well. Also starting her own skateboard company with Leticia Buffoni, Monarch. I'm so pumped to, to see the release and the real, uh, see what team they have. I heard it's going to be sick and we're going to be surprised by yeah, what names they got. It's been a bit of a mystery, but everyone is following along. So stoked for her. But here is Sky Brown's first run. I love how she 270s frontside and backside over the hips. It's so sick. She has such good style. See, if you saw the size of those ramps, if you actually stood at the top of one, that's huge. Her yeah. skating is so mature compared to the last time she was here at X Games. She's really grown up. Getting a lot more technical. Oh, there's that frontside 540 that she did a few years ago as the first woman ever to do that. What more can Sky Brown do comfortably? Big smile on her face as well when she Yeah, yeah she loved it, yeah. didn't she? Yeah. So this, is, I guess, this is the culmination of her runs then, because yeah. it was a final run. I think. Yeah, so imagine she, you get three. What is it? Three runs. I think you do, and you take the top two scores right. normally. I think so, because then you well, can is, you can account for one of the runs you bailed on, and right. you know. Was, yeah. Well, but, she's got a current rank first on yeah. run two, so I don't know how many people have gone ahead of her. I mean, you've done, you know, X Games final. You're probably going to have. 15, 20 other competitors at that mm. point. Well, right. I never get skateboarding wise. I always find really impressive, but it's probably dead easy for you and all skateboarders. Is the way day. That was, <laughs> 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 me. So I, I mean, I did it when I was like 11 or 12 as well, but. Oh, that's fine. It's just the way you change. too late to the show. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I felt a bit too old, so I had to give it up. No, it's the way that they swap from. Yeah. Leading with your left foot to the right foot. Yeah, yeah. I just, I have no idea how, how you can do coffee that. Over doing that. Hey, sorry, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I just don't hardly do it. No. I, could, I could barely manage it doing it in one, you know, one way in one stance, but doing yeah, it yeah. both ways. Yeah. The way you just switch it round. <laughs> got to try skate. Got a game on a skateboard or something, right? Let's do the ice hockey first, and then then we'll get on skateboards. Uh, yeah. First place, we saw Bryce Wettstein. Oh, wow, God, that was so Massive. sick. That yeah. frontside three. You do not see many people do that. Her, over those jump boxes. It, it reminds me so much too, Lindsay, of, of when we watched current Caples on the men's side yes. compete in park where that surfing was so evident in his skateboarding. Uh -huh. Same with Sky Brown. 
Even some of the stuff she does looks very snowboardy to me. Like yeah. she just the way she all tweaks everything out. Yeah, yeah. It's so sick. Great balance, isn't she? Yeah. I mean, it just it can't be overstated enough how impressive this performance is. Barely 13 years old. In her for an encore. Is a certain thing? Is this all freestyling? But then a certain. It's it's basically bits that they have to put in. No, it's they can use whatever they want on yeah. this park course, <clears throat> and then they'll they'll get judged on. You know, there'll be technical tricks, there'll be sort of spins, there'll be grinds, all, all so that certain, sort of stuff. certain moves that they doesn't, tend to put in all the time. I, I don't think there's any criteria, but right. if you use more of the park, if you do more of a variety of tricks, you do tricks that are possibly more dangerous right, or, right, or okay. more technical. Yeah, yeah. Get more points. And, yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like I said that exact same thing before her second run, and then she did what she did. I think we just sit oh, back and enjoy. Oh, Indy in the deepest part of the park. I love that every run has been different for her. Well, she can afford to do it. I mean, when you're in first place after run number one. Yeah, that's true. Big old front side air. And when you have the control that she does, you can take chances because the consistency is off the charts wow. for Sky Brown. And those ones are sick. She's just chilled out, isn't she? It's just nothing to it. All smart. On her previous run, she was uh, interfered awesome. with on the lip. I think there was a road board ah, yeah. out there so she'll get one more crack at it someone got in the way of it so this isn't it. quite a victory lap for sky brown not quite yet technically you know sky has so many tricks in her bag that other women are just not doing so much style you know, a lot of her spinning tricks, she started by just flying out of bowls and spinning, and then she started taking that back into the transition. Four for four. Sky Brown, no bobbles, no stepping off the board. It's just not. Yeah. So consistent. Her bag of tricks just keeps getting bigger. And at 13 years old, <laughs> Thing is, she's a legit hopeful for a medal. Yeah. I was going to say she must be going from what the commentators are saying. There, really impressed with her. Yeah. So I'm assuming she's yeah, one she, of the favourites, then, is she? Well, she's won the X Games. Yeah, she's got then to be the good. next level up. Yeah. the Olympics, I guess. Right? Yeah. That yeah. looks absolutely flawless, that, didn't it? Yeah. I don't know with the Olympics if there's uh, age categories or if it's fair game for everyone. Was I that age category that? I don't think so. It didn't sound like it was. No. No, it didn't, did it? Because she went. She was referring to as a woman. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, and I think. To be fair, like when you had uh, Tom Daly, for example, mm. diving, he was with people Men. of all yeah, ages, yeah, wasn't he? It was just open age group, yeah. wasn't well, it? That's what happens when you're in the yeah. Olympics. Open age, no categories, no kids yeah. categories, yeah. is it? That's yeah. right. Yeah, there's no junior ones, is there? So. No. It's, it's just mad at that's 13 impressive. years old. That's pretty impressive, yeah. that, isn't it? You know, yeah, fair imagine, play. Imagine, you know, we don't win a lot of medals at the Olympics usually, do we? No. We, we get a few, but... Uh, you know, imagine getting an Olympic gold medal first year skateboarding's in and it's a 13-year-old. I know, wow. Unbelievable. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, I don't but, think we've got any junior uh, like performers now, have we? Tom Daly's like 25 now. <laughs> yeah, he's, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 probably he's retired. Yeah. I he's in it this year, I'm not I sure, to be it. honest. I think we had, who was it that was boxing female? Nicole yeah, Adams. Nicole Adams, mm. that's the one. And she, she got medals, didn't she? Yeah, yeah. she's retired though now. I think she was pretty young when she first got medals mm. in the Olympics. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think she was supposed to be the youngest Olympian ever. But then it's been delayed a year because of COVID. Ah, uh, right, okay. And now she's just UK's youngest ever Olympian. Yeah, because how old was Olga Korbut? She was, wasn't she 13? Ooh. I'm not sure, to be honest. I she know some of the athletes young. in the 70s yeah, used the, to be really young. Especially the, the gymnasts. The gymnasts, yeah. didn't they? They're normally too yeah. old when they're like 16, aren't they? Yeah. 17. Yeah, yeah. Well, without, without COVID, she would have been 12 yeah. representing yeah. the UK. Yeah. It's cr just crackles. Wow, yeah. It's absolutely crazy, that, isn't it? Mm. But anyway, good luck to her, eh? Yeah, good luck to her. How is she English then, or British? I think she's just born over here. Right. Her parents over here. But she's been a child prodigy for that long that, you know, yeah, she's got one professional to surfer, yeah, right. professional skateboarder. It's just, yeah. just crackers. Right. Yeah. Unbelievable. Mm. Excellent. Cool. Great stuff. stuff. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that too. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit the bell. Catch you on the next one. Cheers, Cheers. guys.